Hellions. That's what these are. Bad boy, skith, evil, pale skinned Hellions. Uh, yeah, I really, really enjoyed uh, painting these. Uh, weren't so happy about putting them together. <laughs> Fiddly little buggers they are, but uh, yeah, I had pure fun painting these, especially the skiffs. I uh, loved the box art. Uh, with the hard edge uh, green highlights and the red uh, writing but I, tr I wanted to try and make it look a little uh, cooler uh, if you like and how I went about doing that is using my airbrush to go over all of the skiffs uh, in red and then a gradient highlight from red to orange from orange to yellow and from yellow to white then I masked off uh, different shapes uh, cutting out different friskets uh, in the masking tape and then uh, once the masking tape had been applied, I went over the whole thing in a, a near black colour, more like a charcoal. Uh, I try and avoid black uh, if I can help it uh, because you want the recesses to always be darker than the, the raised areas. But if you use uh, pure black, uh, you find that you, you struggle uh, to, to get those uh, shadows to pop. So uh, that's my reasoning behind not using black, but it's very close to black. And yeah, I think it's turned out okay. Um, you'll notice that each one of the wings have got a different uh, glyph shape, uh, which which is really cool and you're afforded that ability when you're using masking tape. You can lay it down in any sort of random pattern that you like. And uh, yeah, and the riders themselves, the Hellions themselves, have all got really pale uh, skin tones again, as you can see. And this is a Sarge there with uh, the Agonizer, and I forget what the pistol's called. But yeah, uh, beautiful uh, Minister Paint. I've left, I've not glued them on the uh, bases, uh, you'll be glad to know. Uh, just in case you want to put them on some of those really cool bases that you've been putting your vehicles on uh, recently, Max. So uh, you've definitely got the ability to uh, take them off there and uh, go to town on the bases if you like. But yeah. That is the Hellions. I really hope you like them. Uh, as I say, uh, spent some time trying to get those uh, glyphs uh, working, but I think the overall result uh, it was worth it in the end. Well, I, I think so anyway. Uh, back it in a moment, and uh, I've got some mandrakes to show you. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned for that, that guys. Back with the mandrakes. Uh, again, this is a unit of five, and uh, fairly straightforward painting these. Nothing... Uh, out of the ordinary uh, again following the box art uh, design from GW uh, the only thing that I change which is is quite minor really is I didn't like the dark um, skin tone it's pretty much pure black with the ed hard edge highlights of a gray or a white on the box art and I just don't think it would have ju done the justice of the, of the mini detail uh, the detail uh, of the mini justice so uh, I went with like a, a midnight blue which again is dark because you can't deviate too much I believe from the actual paint scheme because otherwise they're not going to look like mandrakes and uh, then I used uh, regal blue to that mix to uh, bring the highlights up gradually and then uh, obviously a lot more regal blue for the hard edge highlights and uh, I think they've turned out okay I, I love those trousers uh, I don't know the official terminology so I'm going to call them MC Hammer trousers so anyone that was uh, bopping about in the uh, early 90s late 80s can't even remember the dates uh, will remember that bad boy <laughs> but yeah they've turned out quite well as well so uh, yeah uh, let me know what you think Mac um, I've done 20 now so we're uh, coming up to uh you know well i am actually past the halfway mark so yeah i'm getting there slowly but surely and uh for all the people that have sent me pms uh recently i will get round to them which i am doing at the moment uh slowly but surely it's just a case that i've not even been on youtube over the last uh, week or so uh, hardly at all um this uh, commission has not afforded me that much time but uh as the saying goes it's better to uh, crack on with them than uh, sit looking at the uh, boxes. Uh, it's uh, not going to help you at all doing that. So, yeah, we're getting there. Uh, so bear with me, uh, uh, guys, and uh, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And thanks for watching. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe.